Dead Sea. Mr. Omar and his students were on a bus to the Dead Sea. They whizzed past the arid landscape. Mostly, they were just rocks and small shrubs. Finally, they arrived at the lake, where they'd learn about one of the world's saltiest lakes. Wow, look at the color of the water, said Nida, as the Dead Sea came into view. It had gorgeous turquoise and blue waters. Around some of the lake shore were white spots. Is that sand? asked Uzma, noticing the white areas around the lake. That's actually salt, explained Teacher Omar. The lake is so salty that when some of the water dries up, it leaves salt behind. Wow, said Amir. I guess you don't need to bring a salt shaker on a picnic to the Dead Sea. The children all laughed. Finally, the children could get out of the bus and walk right down to the lake. Ready for a swim again? Asked Mr. Omar. The children jumped up and down in delight. Of course we are ready, said Salim, showing off his swimming shorts. They walked into the warm lake. Wow, I can float so easily, noticed Amir. Yes, said Teacher Omar. This lake is about nine times saltier than the ocean, so the water is denser or heavier than us. That makes it easier to float. So are there any sharks in this lake? Asked Nida. No, answered Uzma. That's why it's called dead. Nothing can live in it. I read that in a magazine on the way here. That's right, agreed the teacher. Only tiny invisible beings called microbes can live in this lake. It's too salty for anything else. So what else is in this salty lake? Asked Salim, curious. Well, there are plenty of other chemicals like gypsum and magnesium, said Mr. Omar. Oh, I know about gypsum, said Nida. It's in sidewalk chalk. The container said so. That's true, agreed the teacher. So kids, did you know that we are on the lowest point on Earth? Aside from the deep areas of the ocean, this is as low as you can go on land. Did you see the sign that said the altitude here? Asked the teacher. Let's go see, said Uzma, getting out of the water. The children found the sign that read 1,312 meters below sea level. No way, said Amir. That means we're below ocean level. Exactly, said Omar. The children examined the salt deposits up close. Can we taste it? asked Uzma. Just a little bit, Mr. Omar agreed. It sure is salty, said Nida. Now you've seen a salty lake, the teacher said. We sure have, said Salim. I like the color of this lake best, said Nida. Well, we still have a few more places to visit, said Mr. Omar, smiling. So don't make any final decisions about your favorites yet. The children laughed. Okay, said Nida. I'll tell you my favorite colored lake at the end. With that, the children boarded a bus again to continue their journey. Subscribe today, only on Muslim Kids TV.